Prosecutors dropped Nelly's rape case, but it's far from over. Tony Scott here. Look at Tony's tea. Some entertainment headlines that grab my attention today. Monique Green, the woman who accused Nelly originally of raping her and wouldn't cooperate with prosecutors, so prosecutors dropped the case, has filed a lawsuit against Nelly for rape and defamation. Monique Green claims she was raped on Nelly's tour bus, and afterwards, Nelly threw a $100 bill at her and said bye-bye. Now, originally, she didn't want to talk to prosecutors because she felt like she wouldn't get a fair shake if it went to trial, so she dropped the whole thing, and prosecutors were like, well, then never mind. But apparently now she's had a change of mind and want some money. Chris Brown will star in a Nick Cannon movie that Nick Cannon has written, will produce, direct, and also star in called She Ball. It's about women's street basketball. Also in the movie are Cedric the Entertainer, Evan Ross, Faison Love, and Marla Gibbs. Production has already started. And Tiffany Haddish is clapping back at her ex-husband, William Stewart. Tiffany wrote in her book, The Last Black Unicorn, that she was the victim of domestic violence at the hands of William Stewart. William Stewart did an interview a few days ago and says, that never happened. I've never laid hands on any woman, and I got receipts to back it up. Well, Tiffany is clapping back saying, I got receipts too, like a restraining order I took out on you in 2011, in which she claimed that he choked her and smacked her around a little bit. At KRNB.com, a Michael Jackson lawsuit has been thrown out of court, and Janet Jackson may have reunited with an old flame. Thanks for checking out Tony's Tea for Smooth RB 105.7. I'm Tony Scott.